Hello everybody and welcome, it's John Pace and today we're going to be comparing a few different microphones using the Rode uh, Wireless Go uh, system. Uh, right now we're recording using the built-in microphone on the Wireless Go and it's in my pocket, uh, similar to the test that we did uh, yesterday. And we're going to uh, compare now to see what the sound is like uh, with the Wireless Go uh, clipped on to my collar and see if the sound is improved now. Uh, so what do you think? Is the sound better with the uh, wireless go in my pocket? Is it better uh, clipped near my collar? Or is the sound uh, about the same? Okay, now we're going to go ahead and compare the built-in microphone to the lavalier mic that's supplied with the Rodelink Filmmaker kit. Okay, now we're listening to the uh, Rode wireless go with the uh, lavalier mic that comes with the Rodelink Filmmaker kit and we're going to see if the sound is uh, better, uh, worse, uh, the same as the built-in microphone when it's clipped on uh, near my collar. Uh, what do you think? Is the sound uh, better? Okay, and one last test. We're going to go ahead and uh, use uh, an inexpensive microphone that can be found on Amazon or a lot of online retailers. It sells for about $25 or less. It's called the MicroDot 6016, and we'll go ahead and put that on and see how that sounds. Okay, right now we're listening to the MicroDot 6016, an inexpensive mic that you could find online, and we want to know whether it sounds better or worse than the lavalier mic that is supplied with the uh, Roadlink Filmmaker kit. So what do you think? Now I haven't had a chance to compare these two. This will be my first time, so I'm gonna go ahead and put on the timeline now and I'll share it uh, as soon as possible. Uh, if you found this video useful, please hit the like button. And if you'd like to see more uh, videos like this, uh, please consider subscribing and we'll see you in the next episode.